Lover 79 here with some Star Wars movie news. Yes, if you have not heard, there was reports today that Disney executives apparently seen a rough cut of Star Wars or Rogue One, a Star Wars story, and apparently did not like it. The reports say that the heads of Disney thought that the film was more of a war film than a Disney film, that it did not have humor, that it did not have the same elements that Star Wars The Force Awakens had. And they, they ordered expensive four weeks of reshoots to add more humor and more fun to the film. Star Wars Episode Seven, which was more lighthearted, more fun, had jokes, but it had what it had with J.J. Abrams. Now, when this movie was pitched a few, year, uh, a few years ago that it was gonna be a war film, that these rebels were gonna steal the plans to the Death Star, that it was gonna be described as a war film. It's a fucking Star Wars war film. Rebels against, you know, the Empire. People still in the plans. It was going to be a war film from beginning to end. And you're fucking bitching because it needs to have heart. It needs to be more humorous and fun. War is not fun. War is not humorous. War is tough. War is grueling. You lose people in war. And I understand it's Star Wars. It is Disney's cash cow. The Force Awakens almost made $2 billion worldwide. And you want Rogue One to be more of Episode Seven than a war film to be more dramatic and darker. I understand that. But four weeks of reshoots, there must have been a problem in between those scenes that either they ordered reshoots because it was too dark and not humorless. It had no humor, basically or it sucks and they saw problems with the film if you're ordering four weeks of reshoots to add jokes and to add humor and to add a heart to the film i understand that but there's got to be a problem with that four weeks of extended expensive reshoots to start shooting in july before the movie comes out in december so add that up child that's four months before the film is supposed to come on december of this year 2016. so what do you want them to do? Crack jokes in between a war, a battle sequence, or when um, you know the female lead is trying to steal the plans? She's saying a joke to Darth Vader, or something to the sorts. I'm a big fan of Star Wars. I grew up on Star Wars. I got Star Wars: The New Hope, the poster, right there. I got Star Wars: The Force Awakens behind me. If you are pitching this idea, to Lucasfilm, and you're saying to Disney it's a war film. I was hyped up for a war film. You know, Garrett Edwards was hired to direct this film. He hired the people who worked on Saving Private Ryan and Black Hawk Down and Gladiator to make this look like a real authentic space war film. And I wanted to see that. I wanted to see the ground battles with the AT-ATs and the rebels on the ground. I wanted to see that. I want to see how they sold the plans to the Death Star. But Disney wants to add humor and to make it more fun and lighthearted. It's basically the same thing where Batman v Superman Dawn of Justice did have no humor whatsoever and people went apeshit because it was just humorless and it didn't make anybody laugh and now the Justice League is going to add humor I just don't get execs like they want it to be funny they want to sell this to kids because it, it's the money the money it's money when Lucas George Lucas sold Star Wars to Disney. I already knew that years ago, they it's about money. It's about the green. It's the paper. Disney wants to be the God Almighty. They own Star Wars. They own Marvel. It's about the money. They, they say they care. No. A lot of people had problems with The Force Awakens. I knew it was a rehash of A New Hope because they didn't even work hard on the script. What is Rogue One about? I said the synopsis in the story. It's about stealing the plans of the Death Star. It was going to be a violent... And brutal battle to steal it but they did it's a war film but you want it to add humor and to make it fun because you want to sell it to children and don't make it so dark and that's the problem so the disney execs are just thinking about the money they said they're thinking about the fans and making sure the product's good i want the product to be good but i hope these four weeks of reshoots don't you know take out some of the battle sequences that needs some of that story or making it be because a war film needs to have that you know that gravitas it needs that grittiness 
to sell the movie, or basically who are teamed up to stop the Empire from destroying all these planets around, you know, the Star Wars universe. But they hear about four weeks of expensive reshoots, and Disney got the money, and they don't care because they just lost a lot of money on the sequel to Alice in Wonderland. So they don't care about the paper, they just care about making money and selling toys. And that's about Star Wars, but I'm a Star Wars fan, I hope that these four weeks of reshoots put humor in it, but it's not J.J. Abrams is directing, it's Garrett Edwards, and if you've seen Godzilla, none of the jokes in his movie even worked either, so we'll see. Alright guys, leave me a comment down below and tell me what you think about Rogue One getting these four weeks of expensive reshoots to add humor and to add, add it to be more fun instead of being a war film. What do you think about it? Do you want it to be a war film? Do you want it to be gritty and, and, and more action-packed to see what happened when they stole the plans of the Death Star? And if it is the Death Star, somebody correct me because I keep thinking it's a Death Star or something else. So correct me in the comments. Tell me what you think about this news. Do you think the movie's going to be good or bad or does it suck? We don't know until we see it in December. Subscribe to my channel for more movie news and other videos on my channel. And share the video with everybody on YouTube. Thanks for watching.